This video is sponsored by AOEH.com. Don't forget to use the coupon SHAKO for a 3% discount on your next purchase. Hi guys, welcome to the stream. Let's go for some cameras, okay? Let's see how uh, am I supposed to do that? Uh, let's see. Not that one, not that one. There, there we go. Have it. <clears throat> I have it already. Uh, got the leg, so <sighs> okay. That good. <laughs> already yawning. Okay, here we go. Hey Keith, well, it's uh, it's definitely not morning. I would say, yeah, afternoon. It's half past seven in the in the afternoon, evening, whatever you say. How are you this mor morning? <laughs> So, it's strange. Well, <clears throat> I guess I killed them already. <sighs> Eleven o'clock. Okay. Hardwood floorings. Nice. I guess that it's not... Yeah. I guess hardwood flooring isn't that common in the US in comparison to... You have a lot of carpets in the US. We don't have that much carpet at all. But we have a lot of hardwood, so um, I guess we're different in that sense. But I'm hoping that everything is running smoothly for you, installing your hardwood flooring. Are you doing like? fish scale hardwood flooring or any specific pattern or just like regular floorboards it's quite common with fish scale hard hardwood floors here
Okay. Well, I guess that's almost standard in in any hardwood flooring today. I placed here in Sweden because the Everything costs a lot of money nowadays, especially since COVID. Construction prices has skyrocketed. It's insane. construction before That's nice, because the general perception about people not living in Sweden is that people in general aren't that handy, because most people here in Sweden do a lot of construction on their own, or DUIs. We kind of give ourselves a pat on the back, like, yeah, we're rocking this DUIs. <laughs> Next game. I don't know if you were able to. I don't think so. you could like post it somewhere and then link it but I don't think yours that you are able to actually post a picture Uh, 
So you inherited the house? So are you DIYing it for yourself or for... What's the purpose of flipping it, a house flip, or just... That is actually a thing that I'm kind of interested in flipping houses. I have done a lot of DUIs and, and renovations uh, of houses. In general, I'm quite interested in, in houses overall, actually. Sorry to hear about that. Well, it's a good thing that you take care of the house and buy it up, keeping their memories in, in some way, but like fixing it up and making it your own. Jordan this time. Monold. <laughs> like always, Monold. Isn't it? Yeah. This is quite rare. It's the rarest uh, in the set. So that's amazing. Huh. So Manol and Triggles. But besides that, no, Dan, no. No good drops, but. Just started streaming and this is game number two, so we're hoping on some high runes. That is the main objective with um, doing cow runes right now. Oh uh, yeah, one hour 
on commuting that is I hate commuting uh, I hate driving from uh, to work and from work it's oh I hate being stuck in a car I couldn't live in places uh, where you had to be in long car queues like all the time I couldn't live in a big city I would I got some serious serious road uh, rage issues <laughs> so I, I'm not good in place I have I have driven in in places where the, the yeah it's just horrible I hate it um, like I said driving to work and off work an hour is a long time <laughs> seriously a long time so yeah but what are you gonna do sometimes you just take the good with the bad I guess so you have a Tesla that's then I guess it's somewhat more endurable if you're if you're driving a Tesla and I've heard a lot of things that a uh, autopilot is amazing I mean uh, yeah <laughs> and if you want to go fast um, then it shouldn't be a problem oh yeah uh, <laughs> traffic jams in LA is like notorious all over the world uh, yeah I don't know uh, I've seen pictures of people actually building together drones <laughs> and droning themselves to different location I mean you could get a uh, one third of your life back if you're living in LA and that was an option <laughs> so I, I guess then that you're you're sitting there and keeping your fingers crossed that some time in the near future the Tesla will do drones passenger drones <laughs> that would have been amazing uh, new game Um, belt glove shield great for poison necro okay I heard a lot of people saying that uh, the three piece trang is good uh, stone of fields That's. I've actually thought about making a poison necro at some point. It looks so nice being a poison necro, uh, running around in cows, just doing one poison nova that everyone buys, and uh, just. Doing one corpse explosion and everyone else in the entire screen just dies. <laughs> Three piece is negative poison resistance twenty five percent. Okay, so that in combination with um like it was what's it called death web and uh, you're set as a poison necro i guess yeah i've tried the orb firewall um i enjoy uh, orb 
rather than Blizzard, but unfortunately, I don't know. It feels like you aren't clearing stuff as fast with orb since the damage is such yeah it, it makes a huge difference uh, when playing uh, I tried it but like for cows uh, I felt that it sucked to be honest with the orb instead of instead of blizzard I felt like I was doing s such low damage and I had to put out like I don't know but four or five orbs just to kill a single cluster of cows so uh, I don't know um, but, but the thing is I, I like uh, frozen orbs the skill of frozen orb better than I feel like you're if you get better crowd control with orb uh, uh, and it's a lot funnier skill uh, yeah I'm, I'm on Keith there I mean I, ha I have tried orb so many times but I just Honestly, I, I'm just begging back to Blizzard every time. My final goal is going Lightning anyway, so I'm just doing cold for as long as I don't have an Infinity. But <laughs> as as soon as I get an Infinity, um, I'm specking lightning at the same second. Is that uh, I prefer playing the lightning rather than cold. Yeah. <clears throat> but besides that, the firewall. I mean, <laughs> when clearing like Diablo and Bale with the firewall damage that you put out uh, it's insane I mean so the actual boss fight is faster but I mean if you're I'm like 6.8 K Blizzard and 3 almost almost 3.5 in the uh, ice blast, you, you take down Diablo pretty fast either way. So, Bale is somewhat slower, but yeah, I have some points in, in Firewall just to help clear Chaos a bit faster. Uh, yeah, I prefer this. Aren't you clearing the chaos? Because that's the main thing when doing Diablo runs. I would say that that is clearing the mobs in the chaos century. Oh, my buddy in the game just found shaft stop. That's an ethereal shaft stop on your mercenary is. Very good. Uh, this is clear. 
Oh shit, they're fast. I'm guessing it's clear, to be honest. New game. Keith, uh, did you need the triangle's belt? Are you running? Rockman, are you finding anything? I have. So, did you have a stream where you're looking for a uh, Jordan? I thought I saw something. Did you find it? Any any soys before? Come join my game, uh, and I'll give it to you. I am. I am not in need of it right now. Anyway, so if you're in need of it, it's yours. If you want it. Got twenty unique rings and two out of those twenty were were Jordans. That's that's insane. I did a uh, just teleport. I suppose I saved up like. Identify like 20, 15, 15 I, I think it's 15 uh, unique rings at a, the same time. I gotta beat K, but no, no Jordans, unfortunately. Uh, yeah, Keith, uh, European server. Word four. Uh, it's funny, I have found so, so many nagels. Any thirty percent uh, nagels yet? I have found. Uh, 
wonder if that's Keith. Is it? <clears throat> Summoning a skill. Ah, Druid. <laughs> oh, man. <laughs> I was kind of ecstatic there for a while. I was just reading summoning skills. Oh, man. But, yeah. <laughs> it was a Druid. Has anyone played summoning? Yeah. No problem, Keith. No problem at all. Wish you the best of luck with your Necro. Uh, bull spirit. Hello again. I'm trying to make a bow of quick chaos room, but uh, that's some expensive. Yeah, <sighs> I've heard a lot of people saying that it's not that big of a difference playing uh, playing uh, wing force rather than faith. Bow on, on a bow is on, but I don't know. Um, actually, bow is on is one of my favorite builds since the re <laughs> since the release of this game. I haven't played one yet since uh, Resurrection. Uh, yeah, but I'm running as uh, Jabba, and um, yeah, that's that's a lot, a lot cheaper in the beginning. So I think you're you're making a smart move in in going uh, Jabba early game, and then. You might switch over to to bows on later when you have either faith, wind force, or whatever. What's that other one called? Uh, the other rune word, like frozen eyes, something. Hmm. I, I think it's something like that. Um, but it, it's an amazing, amazing, funny character to play. I think that strafe is the best skill right now. Back in the day we were always using multi-arrow. <laughs> Such a uh, awesome feeling. Like shooting a widespread of 40 arrows <laughs> with knockback on your wing force. I mean Amazing, super funny builds to be honest. Uh, yeah, so super funny builds. Uh, Amazon is amazing. Yeah, ice is probably the, the rune word that I'm thinking about. Um, just typing my new game to my friend here. Five and five. Uh, Jason, yeah. So you haven't got uh, a perfect nagel yet, either. Uh, oh God, yeah. As some of, some of you guys have seen uh, from my other videos. Uh, I found my wind force in ancient tunnels, actually, so. <laughs> hey, 
Hey, Keith, Keith, uh, Keith's uh, wife, girlfriend. Get some money. Five. Oh, so you got a BK from Kels? I've heard a lot of people getting very nice stuffs from from Kels. And the number one reason why I'm actually running Kels is the the possibility of hiring drops. So we're doing cows until we get a jaw or a bird, basically. Because, as some of you know, I made a promise when I reach a thousand subscribers. Oh, oh you! Oh, yeah. No, it wasn't my. It wasn't my wife or girlfriend. It's. Uh, it was my daughter, actually. My. I have a thirteen-year-old daughter. And a nine-year-old, so <laughs> yeah. My girlfriend is upstairs writing a book. Actually, she is planning on being an author. Everyone has um, goals. So I actually thought that that you, your girlfriend or wife. Uh, wanted to say hello to me. Okay. Well. <sighs> the ogre mal. This is an ogre mal. I have gotten so much crap about this. My pronunciation of this immortal king's mal. I said orge mal. Um, made the. <laughs> uh, I, I mixed up the R and the G. Orge. Instead of ogre. <sighs> you guys have to take into consideration that when this game was released, I was. Uh, how old was I? Oh, okay, so I was 13 or 14 living on the Swedish countryside uh, not speaking a huge amount of English uh, but yeah basically we learned as we go so I have some names so I pronounce things uh, a bit different <laughs> than you're supposed to uh, and some of these names have stuck with me even though I know that it's not orge mal sometimes without thinking without anything I burst out orge mal when I see it it's the same with Nilothok in, uh, in Act 5. We have always said, me and my friends, when we play this game, we always said Nithika. I don't know why, but yeah. So, I am having such a hard time pronouncing a character in this game by their real name, since I have learned from the past 20 years that, yeah, it's Orchmal and Nithika. When it's Ogre Mal and Nilothok. It's easy for what for everyone else that actually speaks English as their uh, native tongue or whatever you're supposed to say Na native tongue yeah <clears throat> but being from Sweden we did our best guys okay <laughs> so uh, sometimes I mispronounce stuff 
I hope that you can see past that. Uh, <laughs> I've learned that some of you guys can't look past that, but hey. Then I am probably not the one that you're gonna watch or wanna watch streams with, of, with, with, yeah. Then you're better off looking at someone that is uh, actually American or s English from the get-go. <laughs> Sorry to say that, but yeah. Because I don't want to offend anyone. So if you, <laughs> if you have issues with me not able to pronounce everything, then yeah, I'm just telling you straight up. You're better watching. You're better to watch someone else. But if you see it from from the bright side, yeah, it's as Keith say. It's okay to laugh. Laugh to me, or laugh at me is, I think the correct term is. You can laugh at me. I, I don't. It's okay. That's why it might be even more amusing because you can laugh at the crazy, stupid Swedish person that can't pronounce names properly. And I misunderstand some things at certain points. That's all part of me. I say stupid stuff and don't get every context every time. quite fast was that what not join game yeah <laughs> yeah Jason Enigma is probably one of the first things you're going for in any builds Where did my buddy go? <laughs> have you found, Jason, have you found any part of of the hyrus needed for your enigma i mean jaw and burr it's they aren't growing on threes that's for sure your first goal or some of your first goal you're saying that enigma is your next goal what was your goal before that There 
There he is. Crusader. <laughs> yeah. Uh, yeah. <laughs> Good to hear about that, John. Uh, John, not John. Wrong. Yeah. The if part <laughs> is well, it's a star, isn't it? I mean, you're one third. There. <laughs> One third of an enigma. Uh, I mean, that that got to count for for something. I mean, if you're not categorizing it further than that, then yeah, you should have an enigma any day. Take you two years to find <laughs> to find it. So you're going on, or is it just one year? So it's one year, uh, a third. Sauron, besides epic drops like uh, if, <laughs> are you finding anything else? Anything good? Uh -oh. Is it getting beefy? Okay. friend is missing out on a lot of chests I would love absolutely love to find me a high rune from one of the chests that he 
missed. That would have been... Yeah. That would make my day. Being able to tease him <laughs> that, he, <laughs> that he forgot a stone or a chest and end up getting high red. It would bum him out for like ever. <laughs> Not in this run though. Let's hope for the next one. <laughs> yep, uh, seven, seven. Okay, yeah. Otto, hello. How's it going? You're more than happy to join. Uh, Cal is almost up. If anyone else feel like they want to join in, then everyone is more than happy to. We're uh, on European servers. EFS is the name of the game and EFS 7 and the password is 7. Sell, 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 sell. It's amazing. I just love seeing a poison nova and then corpse explosion and everyone is dead within seconds. Oh shit, they were not liking me at all. Extra fast, cursed, mono burn. Yeah, every amazing stop it just stop it no one new watching the stream I haven't heard a lot of new people joining the stream lately No new subscribers in a while. That's, that's kind of sad. Uh, I need a key. Okay. Great. Yo. Why can't it be low instead of yo every time? I found a uh, 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 
Yeah, we're just doing cows over and over and over again. Uh, I was thinking about doing a hundred cow runs. And basically, see what you can get from doing a hundred runs. Like I usually do. Hundred runs on something. Feel free to join in if you want to. Oh, there was a key. I got a summoning skiller for for druid before. I have tried building a summoning druid like way back. Have anyone tried to to do one recently? War spike. Okay, so I have a lot of shit. Let's see, war spike. Which one is that? What? I don't know if I've seen this. Crane. Huh. Crane beak. Hmm. I don't think that I've seen this one before. Or have I? It's not that. Hmm. Imagine if those gloves were like to a Java <laughs> or a Boson. It would have been amazing. John is, yeah, John is doing chaos. Uh, well, anyone is free to join. Uh, if you don't wanna run cows, then you don't wanna run cows. You can join in John or anything else uh, in, uh, in chaos runs, I guess. But it feels like this game is done, so uh, game 7 is done. I'm making game 8. EFS 8, password 8. So, Father Howie jumps right in. Did anyone answer me about my question about the druid? I don't think so. Auto, yeah. Catch up anytime you're up for a for a game. Feel free to join. It's always funner if you are more players and. We're increasing the drop rate on everything, so yeah. Everyone just jump straight in. amount of players in a game either way so I think we're good if no one else want to join in
Are you gonna prep your meatballs? Are you making Swedish meatballs? Swedish meat Swedish meatballs is the best. No questions asked. There are no one in the world that makes meatballs better than Swedish people. That's just it. That's a fact. That's an all-known fact across the world. That's just it. The number one capital in the world for meatballs, Sweden. Come on! Shit. I heard. I heard. Some people say that the Italian meatballs is the way to go. No, no not having it. People that say that haven't tried real Swedish meatballs. Visit your closest IKEA and eat some meatballs and then you'll know that the Swedish meatballs is superior. <laughs> yeah. Well, didn't you enjoy the Swedish meatballs in, on uh, IKEA. Not, I'm not talking about the vegetarian ones. Ah, uh, blue boy, he died. Okay, left. Blue boy. <clears throat> oh, finally, finally. Whatever, thank you so much for the sub. Ah, oh, man, I was missing that sound. About time someone subbed. Huh? That's the way to go. That's the sound that we all love. That someone is... Actually enjoying the content. Hopefully. <laughs> Daniel, you have never ever tried Shut put on up with Kia. I mean you should feel embarrassed by calling yourself Swedish. If you haven't tried the, the meatballs at IKEA, I mean, come on. Where's your patriotism? I have eaten like every country outside of uh, Sweden. You should visit an IKEA and eat Swedish meatballs. That should be like a life goal. Well, as always, homemade Swedish meatballs, authentic Swedish homemade meatballs is better than IKEA's. So yeah, you have probably eaten. You, you never visit I IKEA? I mean, why? IKEA has everything. They even have a play area for your kids. So if you want to have some time on your own, you can just put the kids in there <laughs> and yeah, walk around for, a, for an hour or two. Well, now my kids is a bit older and I'm not allowed to to, to leave them at IKEA anymore. 
the small one might actually work if I convince her to to tell the the staff that she's younger than she is. It might work actually. I have to try that. But she has such a hard time lying though it's young my youngest daughter. I don't know. I don't know where she has gotten that from. But yeah. So Daniel wh when you said that you're a kid, then probably your parents should have put you Nah, see, 22 years old, trying to convince me that you're a kid, huh? <sighs> Un this is very unfortunate, but it's only one to Java skills. Yeah, throwing that away. L, raw. Here's the kind of runes that my friend here. Wait, no? Jump. Was he linking something? I don't know. Uh, yeah. You say in one sentence or one breath that you don't visit IKEA, then you say that you have visited Ikea twice if you have visited Ikea twice then you should have eaten meatballs twice it's a known fact new game uh, FS9 I believe it was well, they have other things besides meatballs from the menu at IKEA. They have brunch. That's amazing. The brunch at IKEA. It's yeah, very good. Very good. Uh, but back to Bull Spirit, where or the initial thing was from. Bulgarian meatballs, okay. That sounds... That sounds good. Bulgarian meatballs. <laughs> Keith. <laughs> yeah. Might be the case. Oh, Daniel, thank you. So much for the sub. And Keith, yeah, you're probably right. The the IKEA meatballs need needs it its own video or even maybe a own subreddit or something like that. It's not common. I think it's very common. Well, even though you're not having the meatballs, then at least sometimes, sometime, <clears throat> try the the buffet brunch at IKEA. That's that's actually quite good. It's quite good, to be honest. Bull spirit. What's so special about Bulgarian meatballs? It's funny to hear about. Wait, where is everyone? It's open. Chaos turns by it. Well, everyone is doing their own thing. Well. I don't mind. Mm -hmm. <laughs> T 
Daniel, you love to build him a corv. Okay. Uh, <laughs> for everyone that's not Swedish, uh, we have this. <sighs> I guess we have a lot of Americans here. Try to picture yourself uh, like. What is a big. Uh, a big. Uh, oh, what's it called? Uh, Walmart? Picture yourself a Walmart with majority just car parts. And then they have a shop that sells hot dogs. And one hot dog is like. It's it's like a half fifty cents for a hot dog. That is the build him a corp. It's a kind of hot dog that is <laughs> amazingly cheap and probably has like one percent of meat in it. The rest is like reused tires or something like that. And yeah, <laughs> I don't get it why people eat them. I don't like the taste of it, to be honest. Daniel, I'm sorry, but yeah. It, I love boiled sausages. Uh, yeah, half a dollar uh, for a hot dog. You guys can imagine the quality you get. When you get two hot dogs for a dollar, you know it's mm, supreme quality with a high meat content. <laughs> or not. Man, there's a lot of charms dropping right now. <laughs> I promise you, there, there has to be something like we recycle tires. I mean, how else can you achieve a hot dog for for half a dollar? If you're not putting strange shit in there. Uh, three grand charms, at least some. Uh, no, not a single one is useful. I have eaten a lot of hot dogs in the US and I have to say amazing hot dogs. I had chili dogs at a state fair in Florida. Uh, amazing. Amazing. You, like, you know how to make a hot, good hot dog in the US. I've heard that the US is letting foreigners back in, tourists. The border is opening up, so hopefully I will be able to, to visit you guys over there in the near future. Bullens is Oh man, there you have a hot dog. I mean, yeah, Bullens is the, the real deal. You have this big container, metal container here, that sells in the Swedish supermarkets with a brand of hot dogs that's called Bullens. They are absolutely revolting. <laughs> When looking at them, they're like this brownish, funny looking thing, but the flavor is oh, amazing. Amazing. But yeah, still nothing compared to the. Oh man, I, I had a corn dog a few years ago, and that is amazing. 
first time having a corn dog or a shiller dog. Man, I I want to go back there. <laughs> I want to visit you guys just for a corn dog and a shiller dog. Yeah. When I go to the US, <laughs> my number one thing is visiting all these uh, fast food chains that we don't have here in Sweden like Wendy's oh man I had a burger at Wendy's I think it was called the Baconator <sighs> that's amazing it's such an amazing burger yeah I, I love food. I have a Instagram account here in Sweden when uh, where I make a lot of food. Uh, uh, yeah, so so I'm really really into food. <laughs> and you have a lot of good stuff. Oh, fried Oreos. Oh. What a revelation that was. I mean, uh, uh, your uh, the state fairs over there uh, is such an amazing variety of food and uh, yeah, fried Oreo cookies. Oh, man. <laughs> I get warm just thinking about it. Hmm. Keith, you know the Baconator? Yeah. <laughs> I mean, I, was, I thought it was so awesome. Like, just the, just the name of it. I haven't heard of Wendy's before when going there. And I was like, you have square hamburger meats? Square hamburger patties? And you have, see the name, Baconator. Like, <laughs> like it's... It a, a fusion of a hamburger and like some action movie and you get this and it's uh, it's amazing oh John making chili for dinner oh man I have tried to actually make chili my own uh, here but I ain't getting anywhere near the, the, the flavors and the taste that I have gotten over there unfortunately but yeah I'm, I'm still working on it now guys we have to we have to stop talking about food right now because otherwise I will end the stream and just go for 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 the fridge straight away indulging in weight too much food and going to bed early <laughs> yeah amazing hi Emil how was work find anything good <sighs> John, where did you go? <laughs> yeah, no more food talk. <sighs> That's the thing when you live on the Swedish countryside I mean I live on the real countryside there are no I live in a very small village where we don't have any stores nothing like that so if I got an urge for like a burger or McDonald's or something like that I have to, to have a seat in my car and go 
like over an hour uh, there and, and back. So yeah, let's not talk about it. Cause I don't, <laughs> I don't feel like spending an hour in my car right now. <laughs> But, John, you have to give me the recipe for your chili at some point. <laughs> Still no raindrops, guys. Well, it's only game 10, but not. Any good drops at all, to be honest. Yeah. Where is all the GG drops? Anyone else? Uh, finding anything? Anyone else playing? Anyone else want to brag about some GG drops? On the past few days. Uh -oh. It's good that you hear every time uh, Sean drops. You know the sound. Should be. I I feel like it's, it's kind of hard to hear. Uh, Seventeen. Life. Nah. Nah. It's hard to hear rings dropping. Sometimes they should make a more distinguished sound for rings. Especially hearing cows, since it's kind of hard to see it. Sometimes. <clears throat> what did, where did Bull Spirit go? I guess he's munching on those Bulgarian meatballs. clearing counts even when we're up to three players this is difference between warp and blizzard it goes so much faster than blizzard <sighs> when you're not teleporting straight into cluster of cows and they almost kill you then it could take a bit longer But I have to check that he hasn't missed any. See? He's missing a lot of chests and stones. Uh, I'm guessing we're. Um, yeah, it's clear. So, um, okay. game 11.
I'm thinking about. Let's see. Okay, go ahead, see. Starting to play my old Pokemon within a few days. Such a good game. <clears throat> and one of you that have. <laughs> I need mana. Yeah, such a good, good name. I need mana. I was talking about that the other day. That someone named their character. I've seen a lot of people naming their characters. I need mana. So funny. <clears throat> uh, yeah, oh shit. But back to the point. Has anyone completed any Pokemon games? From back in the day, red, yellow, blue. Yellow fox. Where is he? Oh, there he is. Uh, a CV? Could it be? No. <laughs> I missed. Drop the five percent fast rate recovering cold rest eleven. P that's not that's not bad. I'm keeping that. I'm keeping it. Might use it on my hammer then, or even my Java. me some coffee. Mm -hmm. Who do I need to bribe to get some coffee around here? Mm -hmm. It's almost impossible trying to bribe my kids to get me some coffee. Like my 13 year old Whenever I try to bribe her and making her, can you, get, can you help daddy with that? Yeah, for a hundred Swedish crowns <laughs> every time. <laughs> she won't do anything without getting paid and she wants usually a ridiculous amount of money. Uh, like a hundred, oh, she, he got, what he got, Monald. <laughs> 
uh, like, if I asked her, could you get a cup of coffee for daddy? Yeah, 100 Swedish crowns. That is about 10 bucks. Otherwise, no. Go fetch your own coffee. That's today's children. <laughs> what do you mean, smart girl? It's not smart. The smart thing is to make daddy more enjoyable to be around, and that is to provide daddy with coffee. If daddy doesn't get coffee, then daddy is not as enjoyable. Well, she might get financially settled. She is talking about getting a getting work uh, like on weekends and stuff like that. So yeah, I think she will go far when it comes to when it comes to that making money and stuff like that. Because when when you're 13, when I was 13, I was making some money, but not in that extent. But it's kind of hard to finding a weekend work when you're just 13. So, what she earns in having a, a happy dad a lot <laughs> she lose ten dollars yeah well we can agree to disagree like me and my kids uh, I guess new game. New game. Yeah, that is well. Well. trying to ne negotiate with her over a text <clears throat> let's see how it goes she actually wants a favor out of me <laughs> so I'm I might I just might be able to to get her <laughs> to fetch me some coffee without having to pay her let's see <laughs> Let's see how this goes. Uh, I wait patiently. Uh, yeah, I will go fetch the bird's leg first. Yeah, ten dollars is a lot of money for her, since she's hanging out with uh, friends and stuff like that. And like having a pizza together with friends or taking a not, not coffee but uh, meeting up with friends at a, like a coffee shop and having a uh, like a treat or something like that Is a token worth? Uh, yeah, 
Yeah. That might be the case. Well, Daddy owns tools that can provide a lot of pain to boyfriends, particularly. So. She is uh, not eager to to have uh, her boyfriend over since that it can be so embarrassing. I mean, oh my god, that you're so embarrassing. I mean, what's the point in, in being a dad if you can't be embarrassing? It's like part of the job. That's my honest opinion. That, that it, it's my right as a father to be... <laughs> to be like that. <laughs> Here she comes! She's actually bringing me coffee. There he goes. I can get her doing anything. <laughs> uh, yeah, a token is like a pull to um, I guess. Unfortunately, the weapon laws in Sweden are quite restrictive, so yeah, but I might just get a, a replica uh, and just, just for the fun of it. <laughs> I, I wonder what would say corpse mourn corpse mourn I yeah juiceless unfortunately Ancient axe. I mean, there are some unique dropping, but nothing good. We have found two unique rings within 12 runs. They turn out to be two monolds. Are we cleared? Looks like it. Uh, Avenger Guard. Two sockets, two to work right, 31. No. Uh, I guess new game. <laughs> that the experience was supposed to be better than it is but maybe it's because 
I haven't gotten like any experience at all in 12 runs. I mean, I have, I thought I was over the first two bars before starting the cover runs. Is it that bad? Doing cover runs? Yes, it is. Well, I know that it's better to be doing bait runs when it comes to experience, but I at least thought it would give some experience doing cover runs. Daniel, yeah, that doesn't work on her. She just says, uh, when I say something like that, she tells me that she's adopted. <laughs> so, <laughs> she's, she's not stupid. She always has something to say about anything. Whenever I say something, she has a comeback on everything. It's kind of annoying, actually. She's... Yeah. <laughs> oh, come on. Guys, What's the best you have found during cow levels? I don't know if I have found anything good or anything that good in cows at all. So I need to hear s stories about you guys fun finding this amazing stuff. So I get pumped and get my expectations up a bit because right now it feels like there's this is just a waste of time so tell me about your amazing high rune drops that you're getting from from this from running cows Vex. Hoping every one of you would. Do. Oh. <laughs> Daniel, you're just making this feel more useful, uh, useless in doing these runs when you're saying stuff like that. I was, I was thinking that you should pep me in. Yeah, there are so many high rune drops in, in cows. Keep on going. You got this. But we're just. Yeah. You can find a lot of good bases, but many people are doing cows for high runes as well. But yeah. We'll see. After a hundred runs, have we found any high runes? <laughs> well, Keith, yeah. I'm happy for you, but like Vex isn't the highest possible rune drop there is.
what's so special about Bulgarian? Bulgarian. I'm I'm happy for you that you found a bex. <coughs> I was stoked when I found my first vex, and it actually was my highest ruin drop at the time. So. I would get excited finding a uh, Vex also, but my expectations are Jaw and Burr. So, yeah, but you're, you guys are misunderstanding what I'm, what I'm trying to, to, uh, to get here. I'm trying to get you to tell me the amazing finds you're getting from currents. Uh, not everywhere else. Because I have been looking everywhere else for a high rings. I have done chaos. I have done travicles so many times that I want to puke. And I'm not getting any jaw or burr. Yeah. So I need to find my bird and my jaw. And I'm planning on doing so in cows. Right now. You better watch it. Pay attention because within the few hundred or thousand runs, I'm gonna find a jaw room in here. That's a fact. You just watch. You guys just watch. Uh -oh. <laughs> Full rev. I have a lot of those already. Oh, 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 oh. Yeah, it's a lot of RNG, but <clears throat> I mean, you're killing a lot of mobs very fast, so it should be. Ooh. The probability is quite high. Go by probability alone, then the best thing is killing as much mobs as possible, as fast as possible. So, taking that into consideration, cows would be a very good place to farm for high rings, but we'll see. At some point, a high rune needs to drop. And I got a good feeling about this. Getting 
some people in here. Has anyone? Uh, I mean, at this point, it's quiet. You might just check lower curest uh, chest since we're getting a few more people in the game. So that is a sustainable way to go. Uh, and one of the fastest ways to go to find your high rooms, I guess. But it builds on that there actually are a few people in the game. <laughs> Antonio, what's up? We're trying to make some covers where, or at least I am looking for Hyros. And why not farm cows for them? And another thing that is quite good in cows is charms, I would say. I have found a lot of charms in, in cows. Uh, new game, MG. Game number 15. Because 15, password 15. Hey guys, don't forget to subscribe to the channel so you don't miss out whenever I go live. Blue ceremonial javelins. Yeah, I wouldn't say that it's GG number one drop, possible drop there is, but yeah, it could be something. It all kind of depends on what you got to start with. You guys think that uh, you should all go just blue, everything blue. <clears throat> I need a set of keys. Secret Kalo pits, only one in, yeah, I might just, why not, I mean, upping the chances, Frisco, it's the same for me. Uh, well, I have found a lower rune. Um, that is the highest rune that I have found. Uh, I found it in Chaos. I have also found 
uh, Ohm in Chaos and by the council members next to Mephisto. Uh, yeah, not any room higher than the low ever. So <laughs> I'm I'm trying every possible angle there is just to find a high room. Hi Buddhas. Hope that everything is okay over there in Austria. Socket false block block chance monarch. Yeah, it might be for some specific builds. I wonder what kind of builds that's valid for. You know. Depto, what kind of builds is it that use uh, that high amount of a block rate? And what what kind of jewels are you putting in there? In mean, because you can't do uh, any rune words <coughs> on a blue base. So you have to do something else. We got a town portal. What? This is a sunny day, okay. So it's a uh, whoa that hurt that hurt a lot. So you're putting in four So you're playing with uh, four increased attack speed jewels on um, four socket monarch shields. So yeah you get you basically get <coughs> like 60% increase attack speed on the shield alone. Yeah, I get that. On a Javazon, that's insane, I guess. It feels kind of expensive. <laughs> Man, people are really missing out on chests. 
And I'm guessing new game. Fifth, 16. Uh, mental? Yeah. Who plays with F1, F2, F3? Uh, I do. Are you? What? Nah. I'm good. I'm good. I'm good. I haven't. What do you prefer me using without using F1, F2, F3? Yeah, Mano, it's European servers, EFS 16 is the game name and 16 is the password feel free I'm inviting anyone that wanna join in to come helps us getting some better drops so yeah everyone that's oh, come hey stop it everyone is more than welcome Oh, okay. Well, I don't know. <laughs> it's one of those things when you have played a different kind of, of style, it's kind of hard changing that up. I guess it's faster and better using, for you at least, it's better uh, for using ASDF but <laughs> I think my my mind would be just yeah I, I don't think that would be that efficient for me at least not for <laughs> for quite a while <laughs> you get used to it but it takes too long I guess Is he running on his ethereal titans? I want an ethereal titans. Oh, so bad. On oh, my Java. Aren't you running mental? Aren't you running infinity? He's not that rich. Yeah. Uh, 
<laughs> so we'll say infinity? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, we're saying that infinity is for. Whoa. It's only for rich people. Infinity is for rich people. <laughs> Imagine having an infinity, then I would be running everything with my Java or e Oh! I have Griffins. I have Griffins on my on my Java, but no. No ethereal. Stuff. No ethereal titans. John, have you heard from... From Adam? Anything? I haven't seen Adam for a, a few streams. Yeah, Buddhas. There, there are gonna be some changes with the the upcoming, uh, with the upcoming patch. That's for sure. Yeah, John. <laughs> Infinity is nice. And rune. Well, runes are dropping. It's just not. <laughs> it's just not the. The higher ones that we're getting. I'm guessing this game is cleared. No, just quiet. Not completely. Yeah, I was gonna work some trade out with with uh, Adam. He had some ethereal titans and a th thunder gods. But yeah, as I said, I haven't heard from him. Uh, okay. 17. 17, 17. Hmm. Okay. Yeah. Everything. I I just hope that they will continue on doing improvements and doing patches frequently. So. Yeah, that you can set the the player difficulty on. Um, yeah. Mold spirit, thank you for uh, joining. And I will see you in the next one. Don't eat too many Bulgarian meatballs until then, okay? <laughs> Have a good night.
20. Nice. Drops, not yet. But we're doing our best. But now everyone is leaving. We were almost a full game. Before? Wing the hell. Nice. I don't know how many G faces I have found uh, <laughs> thus far, but <laughs> it's a lot. I think that has to be that and that uh, Dusk Shroud. Uh, what's it called? The Dusk Shroud set armor. <laughs> Those had to be my most frequently found set items <coughs> in the game ever but no unfortunately no good drops but slow and steady wins the race right Hoping that someone is finding anything. Hmm. I mean, within one hundred currents, we should be able to find something. Well, I mean, there are so many cows that you're killing with in one uh, cow run that it's. It wouldn't be. I feel like there's a. Uh, it's impossible not to find anything within the 100 cow runs. So, we'll just keep on going. Javas are so insane. Shell. Shell and tall and tall. God, how many shells have we found by now? Huh? This this is this is kinda stupid. Getsemani? 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 I might pronounce that wrong. Sorry about that. Are you playing at the same time? Gets uh, infinity, then an uh, enigma. I mean, the Java is clearing everything in a few seconds. <laughs> I mean, doing like chaos runs with a Java, it's insane. 
I don't think there is any class that actually has a faster clearing time than uh, a Java. Mm, oh, you're at work. Okay. 11.48. Yeah. It's uh, nine o'clock. Uh, it's nine o'clock at night or evening here in Sweden, so. But I'm guessing that you usually play. What's your best drop that you can share with us? Thank you so much, Matthew. Much appreciated. I love hearing about it. all these wild stories about people finding amazing things, so please, someone I've heard a lot of people getting useful stuff from cows besides hiring so I'm hoping that is not just BS and we're doing this right now and we're gonna get some amazing drops but uh, me myself I don't think I have found anything super special Runs. Yet. That's just the thing. Yet. I haven't found anything good from cows yet. I'm just waiting to pop open a, a chest and getting a jaw. Stone of Jordan or Ameris. That's my expectations of doing a hundred Kelrens. That's the least you should get. I mean, there are a lot of runes dropping. I mean, there are a lot of tolls, a lot of shells. We've seen a lot of shells. So we know that there are. A possibility of runes to drop. You just need to be a bit higher, but it's a good sign that runes are dropping. If we didn't get any runes at all, then that would have been quite disturbing and probably not the best place to find or farm runes from. What belt are you using on that Javazan? A lot of people use Razor Tail instead of Thunder Goods. Thing I need for white monarch. I don't. Not a lot. I usually found find at least one monarch within 
10 runs. I found a lot of white monarchs and in cows. Oh, need to pay some attention to the game. <laughs> uh, yeah, so BK is awesome. A perfect BK from cows. I like to sound that out. I really like to sound that out. Tall's armor is also very nice to have if you don't already have one. Uh, okay, this new game. Boothas is on PS4, and I'm get our wait our okay. Yeah. Mental, what belt are you using on your Java? Our uh, our race today. Okay. Nice, nice. A lot of people say that you should use Razor Tail. Are you saying that console, each console uh, have their own dedicated servers? So, not. So, if you're playing on PS4, then you are only able to play with other PS4 players. And if you're playing on Xbox, then you can only play with Xbox and with Nintendo. You have to play with Nintendo players. Is that what you're saying? Okay. Uh, I get why people that are used to playing on PC gets frustrated by this because such a huge thing about this game is the trading aspect of it huge part of the game in my in my opinion it's a very huge part of this game is actually trading Thank you so much, Mantle, for subbing. Yeah, but <laughs> I've heard a lot of people saying that it's very hard, and people actually make Discord servers to be able to trade in this game. You are Discord trading. I mean, I'm, I'm sorry guys, but I would never play this on, on console when I'm hearing about all these difficulties. A major, major, major part of this game is, is trading. So, yeah. Actually, one of the funny things about this game is trading. Well, I guess some people just like playing uh, a single player and that is basically the same as playing on a console then maybe, but I wouldn't play single, single player either. I don't get the point in playing single player and I, uh, uh, but newbie ha have you played this on 
PC, like the original game. Because, uh, yeah, I don't know. Because this is, <laughs> it's such a huge part for me, trading. So, I, I don't know, I, I can't get past it. Sorry, but, but I just can't get past that. Not able to be, not be able to trade. Well, if you, I guess, if you really love the game and you only have a console, then, yeah. I guess you have to somewhat accept the, the terms of, of it all, but, yeah. Hmm. Here we have a monarch shield. I have so many of them. I'm not even gonna pick that up. Mental, what is your charge strike damage? <clears throat> it must be something insane. Point three K in charge strike. <laughs> That's amazing. Uh, new game. We're going through games pretty faster. Well, when we have a, a Java that is putting out that amount of damage, then I guess things go fast. Yeah, you be. Uh, I've heard a lot of people saying that. Yeah, it's the matchmaking thing that and the lobby and stuff like that. That is the issue, and that is why I've heard a lot of people <laughs> actually putting together Discord servers, uh, like creating trading communities on <clears throat> on different kind of. Uh, consoles but I'm guessing that if you're if you're only able to play with PlayStation players on PlayStation servers it might be a very limited uh, possibility of actually trading with other people even if you're able to to actually go through the hustle of creating a discord ser server and stuff like that Will 
Wilson. Thank you so much. Septic. Sep what? Here. He's throwing away good, good charms here. Like a 6%? Isn't that, isn't that bad? Uh, I'm throwing away a 5 and putting in a 6. <laughs> Whoa. TA, that sounds amazing. Just accidentally finding <laughs> uh, a torch. That's nice. And a sorceress torch as well. That's that's awesome. What's the roll on the torch? Anyone else up for some cow runs to help us up the, the drops somewhat? Everyone that want to join, feel free to join the game. We're playing on European servers. Uh, the game name is EFS20 and the password is 20. Like I said, anyone that want to join, just come in. Come in, come in. 16, 19, yeah, that's, that's, that's good. I think that's better than mine. Yeah. That's not bad at all. <coughs> With mental in the game, work. Clearing it so fast that we we need about five more people. So up the the drop rates and making them last longer than a few minutes. So guys, come on in. Join the game. Neff. What? Small charm. Yay! Moonlight! Hey, Rockman! I think it's cleared. New game. Twenty one. Uh, playing color. Okay, so you have forums on the console. Blizzard trade forums. Okay.
That's good. JS pay. JSP, okay. Well, that is, I guess, if you really wanted to trade, then you find ways of meeting your meeting your needs, I guess. <clears throat> so that's awesome, because, like I said, I I I personally think that trading is such an amazingly funny thing and a big part of this game so uh, I don't think that I would enjoy this game as much as I do if I weren't able to trade come on go in there yeah <clears throat> i get that it's you don't have the lobby in that sense that we do <laughs> what is he saying Dude, where did the stream go? There you go. <clears throat> yeah. Rockman, we need to keep up because he's clearing this game so fast. Yeah, Boothas, uh, yeah, I totally agree with you that it, you feel a lot better finding items yourself, but if you're going to find everything that you want in this game for yourself, like doing a single player kind of thing, then yeah, you're better off setting the difficulty to 8 players and just continuously run lower curious chests like forever like doing a thousand runs of, of it but that's the thing it's so easy super easy actually uh, to find runes in that way because you can you have a set map you know where everything is and if you set the difficulty you have a bigger probability of getting runes so yeah I I, I think that's kind of cheating to be honest I don't know you might not share my opinion but I've seen a lot of streamers, uh, YouTubers that are playing 
on single player with a set difficulty and finding like high runes every other day. Why is that? They're clearing everything super fast. They don't have to look for the pathway to anything. They just kill. And fast. I mean, half of the time you're actually looking for something. You're looking for a way down, for a way up, whatever. That's half the time you're playing. You're actually looking for the right path. In 22. So yeah, do this. Absolutely. Find as much gear for yourself as possible. But if you're not able to trade anything in this game, you have to throw away so much stuff that is useful for someone else. I don't know. We, we might just have different views and different takes on things. But Where did mental go? Are we going to have to clear clear everything by ourselves? Just what I needed. Shell rune. That's one positive thing with the release of Resurrected uh, that we have shared stashes <laughs> and makes mewling a lot easier <laughs> than back in the day so yeah it's good to have five that you have the possibility of five mules and that you can swap between them quite easily but yeah Lightning and cold. Hmm. Where is all my GG drops? Huh? down to like the last two three runs here time is running out I need to go to bed soon since I'm 
waking up at like five o'clock in the morning. Okay. <laughs> Come in town after. That sounds serious. What's up? Peace. Okay guys, I really enjoyed playing with you and I hope to to see you guys again, play with you again. And I know some of you are already subscribed to the channel. If there is any one of you other guys that aren't sub to the channel then hit that subscribe button uh, so you don't miss out on my next stream uh, but for everyone have a good night a good day a good morning evening yeah whatever whatever the time is have a great day guys and until next time peace